conditions made for difficult driving in the Sierra since yesterday. KTRA 3's Natalie Burnell is along I-80 with drivers trying to make the most of this slow drive. As another storm hammers Interstate 80, drivers just want to know when winter will end. It's spring, you know, but it's crazy. The weather's being bipolar with us, you know. Cars lined up to put chains on. Some just relieved I-80 reopened after whiteout conditions prompted Caltrans to shut it down. Tiring, exhausting. Um, roads were closed this morning, so we were hoping to head back. But a few hours after I-80 reopened only to cars with chains, conditions created problems for unprepared drivers. A lot of cars sliding, you know, some some accidents. A lot of whiteout conditions, spin outs and all that. So the slow commute making for some much needed pit stops for families like Amy Fortes. Just, I've never seen it snow so hard. I mean, it does. It's walls of snow just coming down. Their family home in Truckee has been buried by snow all winter. And after a quick getaway, Do you want to go home? You ready? You go they're home? heading back to make the most of weather that never seems to end. And looking ahead into the overnight hours, Caltrans says if you can avoid Interstate 80 altogether, they recommend it. Chain controls will be in effect until at least Monday morning. And depending on conditions, they say it's not out of the question for the interstate to shut down again. Reporting along Interstate 80, Natalie Brunel, KCRA 3 News. And chain controls are in effect from Alta to the state line for passenger cars. And good news for truck drivers, the interstate has been reopened for trucks with chains in both directions. That was just announced.